Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Nick with Blogging with Funnels, and I was just holding up my 20-minute uh, sales funnel blueprint. And so, in this video, I'm going to go over how you can easily and almost effortlessly, effortlessly create a sales funnels inside of ClickFunnels in 20 minutes or less. And so, this is the basic funnel that we're going to go over today. We have an opt-in uh, sales page or a one-time offer page, order form order confirmation and a thank you page. So this is a really basic funnel. And with this 20 minute sales funnel, we're going to assume that you kind of have most of your content and your copy written because obviously it's going to take more than 20 minutes to write a or create a high converting sales funnel that uh, you can get traffic and of course get leads and make sales. So I'm gonna hop off a webcam and just do a screenshot video so you can see right now inside my ClickFunnels account already. Uh, but I'm gonna hop off of webcam. So now you're just seeing right now inside my ClickFunnels account. Uh, so this is the dashboard. If you uh, decide to start your trial, this is what you're going to see. Uh, I'll talk a little bit more about this later, but I want to go over the, uh, you know, the 20 minute sales funnel. But uh, if you start your two week ClickFunnels trial under my link, you'll have free access to my funnels and Facebook ads course for bloggers and business owners. Uh, I have done really well blogging with ClickFunnels, so the course is tailored for anybody that blogs or vlogs or does, you know, adds value and integrates, uh, you know, any landing pages and sales pages to make money. All right, so how are we going to do this 20-minute sales funnel? First, we're going to click Add New here. So this is Add New Funnel, and so we want to sell a product. This could be also a service, so we're going to pretend this is a digital product. And so I just want to do a basic sales funnel. And now ClickFunnels is going to, after I give it a name, 20 minute sales funnel, why not? So I'm go I named my new 20 minute sales funnel. And so now it kind of auto populates what your funnel is going to look like. So this is a basic funnel. You can do, you can do away with order confirmation and just go straight from order form to thank you page, which is what I usually do. Order confirmation is good because it's, you know, transparent, like your payment went through, your payment will be, uh, you know, Nick Garcia on your bank statement, yada, yada, yada. So we're going to do a squeeze page, which other name for is like landing page, your lead magnet, like what, how are you, uh, you know, getting people to know, like, and trust you, adding value, all that good stuff. So we're just going to choose a basic opt-in. This is one I created that does really well. All right, so just pretending that, you know, I had all of my content written and all that good stuff. So I would, you know, say I'm going to offer uh, 99 killer email subject lines. And right here, I'm going to say, use these headlines to um, use these subject this is why it helps to have your content written because then you could just kind of copy and paste to boost your email open rates because you know obviously if your email doesn't get open it's like you never even sent it and I'll just put that there there we go all right so that's really simple obviously I would change this this is for my health uh, health business uh, so now Right here, I have a custom code, which I put my Facebook page in here, which is another thing with ClickFunnels. You can add any custom code. This is for my Facebook page for social proof. I have over, you know, like 20,000 plus likes. So obviously I like that in there. Uh, you can put, say I wanted to add an image of, you know, somebody that likes my stuff. Boom, just added a little image here. Oops, I need to click that button. All right, so this is, here we go, adding a quick section. See how easy it is to just create anything you want. Boom, let's put an image in there. I actually took the long way, believe it or not, to put an image in there. And here are all the images I have uploaded, so I can add anything that I want. I'll add that one just for purposes. Oh, it's huge, easily change the size. There we go. So now I would want to create this pop-up here and integrate it with my um, with my email marketing 
uh, provider, which I use GetResponse most of the time. So integration here, I'm going to use GetResponse. I'm going to add them to a campaign, and then you could just choose what campaign you want to add them to. Okay, and then it's connected. So we're going to save it. And so I'll preview this. So we have our squeeze, squeeze page done to offer our awesome lead magnet. And so you'd send people to this website right here. They're going to put their email address in there. And then where they're going to go to your sales page or your one-time offer page. So this is something that you, you know, you'll learn about studying click funnels and sales pages and all that good stuff. But, you know, since you already had somebody to give you a small yes by the getting you, giving you their email, uh, you can kind of, you know, if you added enough value, you can now like, you know, uh, offer them something of even more value. So in other words, you say like, if you liked my free stuff, you're going to love my product or service. So I'm going to pretend like I'm going to shoot a video for this. So say I wanted to add a headline to my video. So there's a template already for that, but I wanted to show you how easy it is to add a headline. Um, so if I'm offering email subject lines, then I want to, you know, stay kind of congruent. So I'm going to offer, uh, an email course, an auto responder email course. All right. So I added that there. I just want to move this above my video. Boom. Easy. And so I've already shot my video. And so I want to just, you know, add it from YouTube. I'd put my URL in there. Let me grab some type of URL so I can show you this is just from a video that I shot a while ago there's the URL all right so put that URL in there it's gonna save it automatically once I save and so then I'm going to uh, add my order form URL go to website URL. This is where I put my order form URL when somebody buys my product. And so let's save that. All right. It needs some metadata. So I'm going to put autoresponder course. I'll, obviously you want to do a little bit, you know, better content than that, but I'm just giving you a quick tour here. All right. So here is a headline. Here's the YouTube video that I put in there. And once I click this, then I'm going to go to the order form, which I'm going to create. So we have the squeeze page, the sales page, and now we're going to work on the order form. And ClickFunnels has just like squeeze and sales pages, they have awesome templates for the order form. And here they are. And these are all customizable. So I'm going to select this one. I like to put testimonials and images in my order form. So ClickFunnels makes it really simple to do that. All right, here we go. And so I would add my own logo here. So let's pretend this is a logo for my autoresponder course, email autoresponder course, and then I would put my bullets. And so right here is where you decide, you tell ClickFunnels what information you need. If this is a digital product, then you don't need shipping. And so we would delete all of this. So you wouldn't need shipping there. We'd hide. Okay. Hide shipping. All right. So if it's a digital product, I just want their name, their email, and not, I wouldn't honestly even want their phone number here. Sh hide phone number field. So, uh, you know, and, and the less information you need, the, you know, usually the more people that will, you'll have filled out. So you can actually even make this a one-step thing where you have the billing info showing with the name and email address. Uh, the good thing about this is more people will, will give you their name and email before they give you your billing info. So then you could follow up with them and say like, Hey, I noticed you visited my order form page. Why didn't you buy type of thing? So it's super customizable. I'll just put that image in there. That would pretend that's my autoresponder course. And so this you'd integrate into your Stripe or Braintree. Most people that use ClickFunnels use Stripe. You can add your 30 day money back guarantee, et cetera, et cetera. So let's save this order form for auto course. So remember you already have your content. So you would just need to copy and paste all these bullets. Uh, all right, let's preview that. 
And so, you know, you need, of course, you'd put like how much it was and all that stuff when you customize your order form. But then I'd enter in my info, enter my email, and you go to step two, put your billing info in there, credit card and all that good stuff. All right. And so that is your three main steps. And I'm just going to end it at that because then you can make, you can create your order confirmation page. So this is where you say, thank you, your order went through check your inbox you can download your digital product from here here are the templates for that and then your thank you page which i you know i just honestly i don't use an order confirmation page i use a thank you page and say your order went through uh you've made an awesome decision here is support email join my facebook group etc cetera, etc cetera. and here are thank you page templates so it makes it super simple now this video was not 20 minutes long, but you can see like if you did have all of your content, you could create a sales funnel very quickly and start making money right away. If you had your digital product ready to go, then you know you just figure out what lead magnet you're gonna give. If you have a fitness product and you're it's like a you know 30 day uh, metabolism makeover, then you would give away like a metabolic seven day sample meal plan. Uh, give that away. Next page, you'd have your uh, sales page, your one-time offer. The next page, you know, of course, you'd try to sell from there. You'd put your order form, your thank you page. If somebody did not purchase, you, you'd enter them after you gave them that freebie, that lead magnet, the, you know, the first uh, touch of uh, no like and trust, you'd put them on an email autoresponder and then send them to that sales page again. So you're constantly staying in touch with them, adding value to their lives and making money. And you don't have to worry about all the website stuff. It's awesome. So if you'd like to try out ClickFunnels for two weeks with my help, then click the two week trial ClickFunnels link below this video. Uh, start your two week trial. I get notified when somebody joins under my link. I am an affiliate for them because I love them so much. But I just don't want you to sign up and then, you know, I, you, ClickFunnels has awesome support, but it helps when somebody guides you that has spent thousands of hours on this like I have over the past couple years uh, and already can help you create funnels. I've, I have 19 funnels here, 86 pages. These are all rocking and rolling different types of funnels. And so I will help you create your first sales funnel. Um, if you're in the fitness health niche, I have lots of products and do really well with that. Uh, real estate, uh, if you are blogging, that is kind of my forte. I can help you set up, you know, click pops and lead, lead magnets and generators, super easy. So click that link, start your two week trial, experience all the awesomeness ClickFunnels has to offer. And uh, if you have any questions, just shoot me a comment. Um, my group to my Facebook, uh, Facebook page group link is also below this video. So hit me up. Talk to you soon.